there are seven seals. Jacob lifted up his eyes, and looked, and, behold, Esau came, and with him four hundred men. And Jacob divided the children unto Leah, and unto Rachel, and unto the two handmaids. And he put the handmaids and their children foremost, and Leah and her children after, and Rachel and Joseph hindermost. And he passed over before them, and bowed himself to the ground seven times, until he came near to his brother, Esau. Jacob said, Take, I pray thee, my blessing that is brought to thee, because God hath dealt graciously with me, and because I have enough. And he urged him, and he took it. On the opening of the seventh seal, there will be silence in heaven about the space of half an hour. In the right hand of him that sits on the throne is a book written within and on the back side, sealed with seven seals. The Great Spirit will restore sovereignty to the tribes of Native America, and will restore their lands. He is Yahweh, Allah, the Most High. He is wise and informed, and gave Abraham Isaac and Jacob. Each of them were guided. This is April Shaltais, a victim of genocide, the genocide of Jews, Muslims, Africans, Native Americans, and more is still a reality. Modern genocides include the Weaver family at Ruby Ridge, the Davidians at Waco, and Native Americans at Wounded Knee. Never forget. This is April Shaltais, using the computer to generate this message. This is Rome, and they decided to put me down. So far I survived but you might not, if you fall into their trap. There is a secret out there, that they don't want you to know. Hypnosis is being used against you daily, and a hypnotist can control you. They only need to grab a hold of you, and now they control you from a distance. They can even hold conversations with you on the astral plane, which some people call the realm of thought, or the spirit realm. The well-known science of the mind author Joseph Murphy calls it the subconscious mind. Stay away from astral plane conversations. God does not talk to you. He talked with Moses, and gave Moses his law. God does not harp on you all day, constantly. That's a human, impersonating God, on the astral plane, but it's really a human who's going to cause you damage. These people are into genocide, and they are the same people who practice genocide against Jews, Muslims, Africans, Native Americans, and more. Don't have conversations on the astral plane. Stay in God's word. The scriptures say, for those who have earned evil deeds, a reward of similar evil, and shame will cover them. They will have no defense against Yahweh, Allah, the Most High, as if their faces are covered with dark patches of night. These are the inmates of the fire, abiding therein forever.